believe. Requeese Nexus. He seems a bit sweaty. He is triangling out his... Uh, yes. I don't want the video to be demonetized, but he is triangling out his wazoo. Good kill. Look like another somewhat sweaty player. This is something that I want to showcase. So we are currently in Australian lobbies, right? Uh, we, we've landed on him. He he doesn't even know it, but he's going to be up on the YouTube and he's going to be making thousands of views. He doesn't even have a clue, bro. Uh, yeah, so we are currently in Australia via the VPN. And I want to uh, do like a little series where I go through all the different... All the different... VPN locations and that way you can basically see kind of what's sweaty what's not because everyone just thinks our oh, VPN equals bot lobbies but as it's been stated on multiple occasions that's not actually the case you can actually find yourself in quite like very sweaty lobbies still especially when you're a player like me with a very high KD stop the cap <laughs> Uh, it's going to end up being very sweaty, sweaty regardless. Now, there are some things to kind of counteract the sweatiness. Basically being, oh, he's been third party. That's unfortunate because that he was him. Um, to counteract the sweatiness of a VPN, basically what you need to do is uh, don't don't go to a time zone where it's peak time. Oh, we, we've gone from a, a fella that was slaying out to someone that's running a so, pulley? Is he running the pulley? Looks like the pulley. Um, these bomb drones. Well, take bomb drones out of the game, man. They are too OP. See the way open in the top left says camera bomb drone 001. Next time you use a bomb drone, is it 002? Keep an eye out, see if this guy uses a second bomb drone. And uh, good old bra here isn't um, putting on the same show, unfortunately. Used up all of your. You're not gonna go try and get your loadout, bro? Oh, he's been sniped from behind. Thank you, whoever just saved us. Nation Nelly Ked saved us from bra. Oh, he's being shot already from the mount side. Oh, you got plenty of cash on you. You're gonna repeat this with sniper. Are you him, bro? Are you gonna phase up? Look, you see him. Whiffs his first shot. Fortune. What? Whiffs second shot. Uh, the phase application might not be, might not be void. What's he gonna do? He's worrying. He knows he's on the thing. Oh my god. I mean. I think that's kind of worse on your fellas' behalf. You knew he had height, so why? I can understand you're trying to get more height on him, and well, at the same time, it's kind of like very lax not to think that he would ditch love. See, a lot of people don't actually like a chic island, but hmm, it's okay. I mean, bro, you may, yeah, just give him height, height advantage. Can you? Are you going to win it? No, you don't. And you got thrown knifed. First you went with the snipe instead of when you had a good position to use your SMG. Then you end up jumping down and giving him full height. It's unfortunate. Unfortunate. What's this file running? He's running the Stinger and the Tac V. Oh, you're using Modern Warfare 2 guns? Ooh. Ooh. Well, the attack fee, th th this fella is definitely just watch Sally as a dog's, uh, like, YouTube video of trying to get used to attack fee, which is literally the exact same as the attack eradicator, but not an LMG. Come on, Stano. Stano has seven kills. Seven kills? This gonna be his eight? Oh, he nearly got sniped. And he's down. Throwing knife for the win. Interesting choice that over in Australia, they haven't been updated on Modern Warfare 3 guns. They are still running Modern Warfare 2 guns. Which, supposedly, you know, Modern Warfare 2 guns had a damage 
nerf. That way people would actually like use Modern Warfare tree guns. So I can't hear what your father's comms are, but I'm sure he's still saying this is your time to subscribe to KOHG on YouTube. Tough fight. There's about three three people in this fight. He knows where one of them is. Doesn't know where the other shots were coming from. That is the peak of the roof. He's probably gone inside. This fella is completely lost. He does not know where he is supposed to engage. And he's th he needs to move for his own as well. Your fella common in game might, might just be messing around with him. I won't be able to know because I don't have my headphones on, baby. I don't have my headphones on, so I do not know. Stano. Stano is still just curious of where that first fella went to, but he is moving across the map. Jeez, that's a nice little glide. Doesn't have him broke yet? Oh my god. Nice throw knife. Stano, Stano is sweaty, man. Stano's got the sweat. Does he have the the previous? He's got the previous game's uh, mastery camel. Just noticed on his tack fee. It's not as nice as Interstellar, which I have. N T M. Nice try, man. Oh, how didn't he see him on the far right wall? He's in a precarious position. He's trying to smoke it. Is he baiting him out to go backside? He is. Oh, all of a sudden he realized he was on the back wall. Okay, oh, you're whiffing your shots, bro, but... Oh my god, Stano got absolutely blitzed. Oh, chalked. Absolutely chalked by Pierre Poo. Pierre Po? Pierre Po? Pierre Po with five kills. Just got six. Good jumping shot with the... He's using the pulley with the um, conversion kit on. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. He's going to have to move. He's not going to be in zone. Can't get out that side. Ooh. Oh, nice kill. Quick finish. Does he have any smokes? No, he's got no secondaries to... Uh... Yeah, I think he's chalked here. Oh, unfortunate. See, it just goes to show how vital in this game, how smokes are. Like, smokes are so vital. Dependent, like, it's not just a thing for, like, the bigger map. Like, you need it for Rebirth as well, for the rotations, because there's so much open ground. The Troll Caution Bundle. Right, you've got height, you're going to be able to glide. Are you going to glide to another one of those rooftops and then move over? Or, yeah, he's checking, checking backside. Do you know? Oh, there's a bit of action out to his left. Yeah. Pretty sure he would, would have had a sight on a guy. Yeah, that is loot. I don't think uh, Penguin actually has a notion of <laughs> anything that's going on. Like where anyone is, anything like that. I don't actually think he has has a clue. Hence all the uh, erratic movement. He's using the MTZ interceptor, which is of course broken out of Wazoo. Uh, needs a big nerf. There's a portable radar. Could have picked that up. Got a little insight on where people are. I'm running into the claymore, and the claymore didn't go off. Very very lucky there. I'm, I mean, this guy could prove me wrong, but his uh, game awareness doesn't seem to be all the best, and uh, he's making very erratic movements. Very, very erratic movements. Decisions. Is he still behind you, John? Yes, they play. Good kill. As I said. Probably show me that his awareness is much better than what I'm giving him credit for. Commentator's curse. 
You've got max height here. If someone's going to pull back to him, he's in a very, very good position. He'd be able to peek both sides over the mountain. Yes, you see one down low. Interceptor dead. Nice. 1v1. You've got max height. You can take a little gander. Is he on the other? Is he down to your bottom right? He hasn't shot at you yet. Those penguin pick up the victory from maximum height. Oh, there he is. You've got perfect vision on him here. This should be it. Interceptor. Isn't going to lose. Oh, he, he, he whiffed his shots. He absolutely whiffed his shots. No way. He, He's chalked this chat. He's absolutely... What are you doing trying to shoot with the interceptor from there? He chalked it. Oh, wow. Penguin. My friend, if you see this on YouTube... Fortunate you with that you had max height yeah you, you had the you had everything in your favor there and you threw it outrageous outrageous gg to uh whoever won there oh we're back on our fella pier pole let's go we spectated pier pole earlier on in the oak very good very 